need to see us, sir? Yes. What if I told you that there was an opening for you both? A big one. How big? How big does special forces sound? Special forces? Congratulations. The both of you have been promoted. Okay, so what's the OP then? You two are to go out and bring in these threats. Oh, and do bring them back alive. We need them. Is he enough? Just because it looks that way doesn't mean that it is. You two are to not underestimate them. We don't have a full report on each, so we don't know what other surprises they may have in store. Nothing surprises us. We'll get them alive, sir. I promise that. Very good. You may proceed when ready. Godspeed, gentlemen. Let's go. Let's go. I didn't do anything to the toaster. You're lying to me right now. You did something to the toaster! I haven't used the toaster in like two days. Well, I need the toaster! That's not working! I need toasted orange juice! Toasted orange juice? It's the it's a delicacy in France! I've never heard of that. Oh, what are you doing? Why can't you get up and help me with the toaster? I'm listening to the new Fleet Young album. Yo, really? That's out? Yeah, it is. It's uh, pretty good. Oh, you wanna oh. hear? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll hear. Right, here. Oh, yeah! That's the shit! Yeah! Like toasted orange juice! That's the shit! I've never tried it. We just get up and help me fix the damn toaster. Alright. Are you? Sure about this mission? Wait, wait, hold on. Are you questioning orders right now? No, I just, not exactly. I just don't know why, but it doesn't feel right. Well, I guess you could say this mission's looking pretty shady right now. I'm just gonna take this off now. You know, it's not our right to question orders. Now come on, get your game face on. Let's start, let's do this. If you say so. Fix it. It's not working! Well, you didn't put it in the toaster. You're worthless! Alright, whatever. I'll just get you some more toast. No, I don't need toast! I need toasted orange juice! I need it! I don't know what to, what to do. Take this. You never have the answers, do you? You never want to help me out! Uh, yeah, I've helped you out plenty. Like when? I gave you some ideas for, uh, salesmen and stuff. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I don't believe you. That alarm is saying that you're wrong. That's your phone. Go answer it. No. It's probably not even one important anyway. You're, you're worthless. I can't stand it anymore. Man, whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving. You got visitors. You know this man? Nah, I've lived with him for about six years. No, I have never met this man in my life. This guy's the the guy that records the pillow guy. Hey, I mean it's just a prank. Hey, Is it? book these sons of bitches. So, um, I, I don't think my head really fits in here. Well, you're gonna have to get used to it, sorry. It's kind of hot in here. Well, I'm oh, sorry. Do you, like, have air conditioning? My partner broke the air conditioning what last time. What is this time. music? I never heard this The journey on the path to uh -oh. spiritual... Oh. That, that oh, was yeah. some really... Press on the brakes. Press on the brakes real quick. Holy shit, we're gonna crash! Don't <laughs> worry, I remember my pedals somewhat. Are we almost here? 
go. We didn't even drive or go anywhere. What? What's the holdup? Well, I had to get my partner situated. Hey, silence back there. You have the right to remain silent. Calm down, calm down. Here, have your tea, have your tea. You never say no shit. Hey, put your gun down. We're in the car. Drive. You want to get fired? <laughs> you guys are kind of dumb. I mean, you didn't put handcuffs on us. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, should we escape? <laughs> they lock the doors? Yeah, apparently they're actually kind of smart. What? No way. It's crazy. It's like having actually a driver's license makes you aware you should lock your doors. Yeah, and you're still hitting oncoming traffic. What are you talking about? You know, you should really look. I'm sorry, he learned all of his practicing of driving from GTA. It's Wait a okay. second, I just that realized something. We still haven't left our yard. Does oh, this yeah. guy know how to drive? Does he have a license? He's trying to drive with his gun out. This is where your justice ends. It says here your name is Hank Hankington? Yeah, and what of it? It's a funny name. It's a French or Irish? Uh, you know, it's actually Mandarin. You see my grandma? Enough games, Hank. Jeez. Chill out, man. You heard? It's under control. And that's final. Okay, jeez. I, I, I won't, I, I won't up, argue. Chill, chill out. Go, go have some. Yeah, you know, tea actually sounds like a great idea right now. Where were we? The part where you let me go, that sounds like a good good point. You can't do that, you have a lot, you have, and I mean, I'm not joking when I say this, you have a trash heap amount of crimes on you, sir. Like, I, really? I, I don't see anything. Not, I'm not, sir, I'm not talking about you, I'm talking about just in general, what you've done. None yeah, like yeah, and what what did I do this time? Which one is this about? All right, well, uh, let's see. You burned down a talk show. You spread false health statements about keeping yourself safe during this pandemic. I did the best I could. I was the most professional doctor there ever was. Thank you very much. And yeah, and this doctor says you gave a kid syphilis. I don't. I my. I, I don't have to answer that. <laughs> of course you don't, sir. It's it's all it's all fine. Yo, man, you might wanna, you might wanna answer this. Yeah? Who is it? Uh, you, you're gonna have to come here, sir. Uh, alright, fine. Switch. Two seconds later. Finally! You have no idea how many wrong interrogation rooms I've walked in on. What? No time to talk. Let's teleport. Two seconds later. Whoa! Hey, over here, camera boy. It's camera man. Whatever. Have we got everything? There's been a disturbance where the camera boy was being held. Man, where'd he go? <laughs> Let's go. Uh, where are we? We're at HQ. What, there's like no special name? It's just, just called HQ? I think we should call it High Queenie Fan. Ha <laughs> ha. Why have I hung out with you for so long? Yeah, it's, it's a mystery. Something we hear at this place know all about. Come on, step inside with me. So what is it you do here? How fast can you get me away from this guy? We cover all sorts of anomalies here, all throughout time. Normally nothing is really happening, but today, not quite. Something big is happening. So you guys are like the TVA from like Loki? If you're saying we're time travelers, that's the simplified version. There's a lot going on here. Yeah, I guess you could say we were time travelers, but so is he. Well, or he was in a different life anyway. I'm so confused. Oh, buckle up. This is only the beginning. We're here. The director will speak with you now. Hey, you look familiar. Do I know you? I guess I just have one of those faces, I guess. Good evening, gentlemen. Hey, you look familiar too. Do I know you? Did we go to college together? Shut it, Hank. Hey. Oh. Gentlemen! Go ahead, sir. Time is screwed up. Things are seriously going awry. We suspect it is due to the meddling with specific individuals past. Someone of whom is in this room today. Was that guy? Hey, 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 hold on, hold on now. Hold on there. I'm innocent, I tell you. I I, I just really like gym shorts. Well, you don't need to look good, are you? Oh, thank you. What? No, not that guy. Get him out of here. We don't even need security. They always call him a coach back in high school. Just Ladies. leave. Fine, oh, I guess I'll leave then. Now where were we? 
Reality is screwed and it's all that security guard's fault. No, we believe it is due to the known enemy of yours, fellow man, Dr. Dog. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot all about him, about how he broke out. Yeah, I mean, I was trying to track him down, but then, you know, I, I really need some money, so... Enough! I get it. You, you were a hero. You once had a clear path and a story to fulfill. Then for some reason, you went somewhere completely different. Well... When you put it that way, it is kind of strange how one minute I was a superhero and the next I was a traveling salesman, a presidential candidate, a chef, a doctor, all sorts of things. Even Santa. Wow. Yeah. It's kind of weird how that happened. Completely. But who am I to judge your life choices? Dr. Dog remained fairly low profile until last week. Why? What happened last week? Last week, Dr. Dog stole a time travel unit from one of our European bunkers, unbeknownst to any of us. Our top agents tried to capture him once they found out, but by the time they found him, poof, gone. To an un unknown period in time, to do who knows what. Well, he's evil, so... I think evil things. I think we can say he did evil things. Yeah, great input, Hank. Can we just skip to the part where we get rid of this guy? Like, you, you can dump... You can go anywhere in time and just dump this guy somewhere in there. Oh, believe me. There's a place for that, but you wouldn't want to go in there. You wouldn't even wish that fate upon your worst enemy. The point is, we brought you two here for a mission. He's your guys' villain. We need you to find out what he did. All we know is one week ago, you were considered a superhero, and a superhero's cameraman in the history books. Today, you are considered the greatest threat to international security forever. Hell of a transformation, huh? The biggest. We need you two to go back and stop him. Tampering of that level is seriously illegal. Yeah, how are we supposed to know where he is? It matters not where he is right now, but rather where he has been. You see, he's a very messy editor. Doc will handle setting you two up. Doc? Doctor? Hello? Yeah, I got that. Follow me, I'll get you two set up. Alright, come this way, guys. This is our time machine room, and this here, this is our prototype time machine. It's a bed. Yes. So you're saying I can just go to sleep in this thing and skip time? This isn't Minecraft, okay? Things are a little bit more complicated than that here. Try to keep up, guy. Wait, wait, so I think I got it. You mean to tell me that I can get in this thing and skip ahead the set period of time that we need to go forward? Exactly. This guy gets it. That's what I just said. No, no, no. You said that I could get in this thing and sleep in. I could sleep in this thing and skip time. When actually, it's that you just have to get in it, right, scientist guy? Precisely. This guy. Th mm, this guy's a genius. There's something about. He's so smart. I like something about him. Well, I thank you. You know, you're pretty smart yourself. There's something about you that I really, really like. I hate both of you. Okay, now you two have to go back in time, so set your clocks back. No way, I'm not losing any more sleep. I'm tired of it. That's why you set your clock forward, dummy. Not the fact you know what directions are backwards, forwards, sideways. I don't know. Uh, I, you just hear, yeah. I wish I could come with you two, but sadly I cannot. There's only room for two in this bed, unfortunately. I wish I could come again, but... I just can't. Best of luck, guys. See you around. All right, just before we do this, I'm just gonna let you know, I'm not doing this for you. I'm doing this for my reputation. How nice of you. All right, let's do this. Wow, this time machine has an office chair in it. And whatever you have. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Okay, so he's in our past screen of our reputation, right? Yep. So he's going to the most important times in our life. Yeah, makes sense to me. So we have to go back to your origin story then. That's not my wallet. What? Wallet? Were you even were you even listening to me? Uh yeah. You said something about Oh my god. You have the attention span of a fucking goldfish. I had what what were you saying? What were you saying? You have an attention span of what? a goldfish. It's like six seconds long. Goldfish? That's all I heard. What? What are we talking about? What? Anyways, we should go to like just all the cool places. 
We should go like Burger King first, then Chuck E. Cheese, then Pizza Mountain, then Secret Mountain Fort Awesome, then Dave Mustaine Studio in Tennessee. Yeah. Then we should go to my birthday party when I was 13 and I got a Hot Wheels car that was the size of my dick. Alright, well we can go to all those places after we're done uh, getting Dr. Dog. Who? Your nemesis, the one you've been after for like uh, several years, maybe like three, I think? I don't know. So when should we go back? We should go back in time like five minutes. Or we should go back like ten years later. Bro, we should go back five minutes! No, we need to go back ten years ago. That's why your origin story. No, 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 I remember! It was yesterday! It wasn't yesterday! Oh, I'm driving this thing! <laughs> coach? Is that you? Uh, who the hell are you and how do you know about me being a coach? It's me, Coach. It's me, Pillow Man. I don't have time to explain, okay? P -p Pillow Man? But aren't you filming right now? I don't have time to explain this. Listen, has a dog come through here today? Dog? Excuse me, sir. There are no pets allowed on set. Oh, yeah, I remember that. <sighs> Listen, can you help me get to set? Sure can. Follow me. Where am I? Hey, you. Who, me? No, the stupid looking rock next to you. Where am I? Pacific City, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you just counted the nine. I don't make the rules, I just listen to the writers and whatever they tell me. Alright? Yeah, okay. Look, be careful sleepers. They they hurt. Real bad. I uh, they hurt. Well, what are sleepers? Have a nice day. Warning. There has been a time breach. Omega Alert presence detected in sector 987654321. Hey, wait! Damn. You're going away for a long time, buddy. How long? A very long, long, long time. Uh, how long, 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 long time? It's long, 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 long. Yeah, but how long, 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 It's long, 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 long. But how long do you... So you said you haven't seen a dog here today. For the last time, boss man, there are no pets allowed. Wait a second. We gotta stop the next guest before they come on. And now for our next guest, Doodle. Oh, wait. Oh, never mind. It's just Doodle. Uh, this is this is Doctor Dog. Um, your uh, enemy. No, that's Doodle. Hey Doodle, how's it going Doodle? Oh, oh, that is Dr. Dog. Oh, what, 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 what? No, there's no way, that's Doodle, he's nice. Mm-mm, that one ain't it, Chief. You are a fool, Pillow Man. I wait a long time for this. Today I will sabotage your whole career. <laughs> Doodle! Oh, he is laughably stupid, isn't he? Hey, Pillow Man, I got the uh, the hostage you ordered with uh, with barrels of oil tipped over, just like you asked. And also, here's your Christmas card. <laughs> See ya later, Pillow Man. What's going on? That stupid dog tried to make me look bad. I want you to close off all the exits and make sure he can't get out. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. You can do. But one, I'm still a little confuzzled here. I mean, you see, um, how how the hell are you there and here at the same exact time? What's up with that? Listen, Coach, I, I love you, man, but uh, I don't have time to explain right now, so, uh... A few moments later... Okay, if I were hostages, where would I be? Oh, look, it's, it's, what do you want, Dr. Dog? I'm, I'm a bit busy here. You're too late, Pillow Man. I've already won. And those hostages that I set up will die. And it'll be all on you. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm gonna say the uh, hostages he set up. You, you can't do anything about it because you don't even have dumb, so <laughs> see you later. All right, let me see. Just gotta untie this and uh, look out, look out for that, guys. And uh, all right, all right, all right. You're free. All right, you're free. All right, you're all free. Uh, go ahead, leave, get out. All right, I freed those hostages. So now let me get back to Coach. Uh, I need something from him. I need you to lead me to the cameras. He confessed that he did this to me. Can you lead me there? I got you, and uh, I love you too. All right, let's go. All right, just gotta. Oh no. Well, well, who do we think we are? Oh, son of a son of a who? I don't have a son. Or at least not one that I claim, anyway. Listen, Pillow Man, I'd love to stay in chat, but I've gotta go. Trust me, bro. You won't regret this in about, uh... Let me see, the four, five, six... Uh, a bunch of years from now. This isn't happening. You're probably one of those guys from the CW trying to turn my name into a teen love drama and claiming it's a superhero show. You have to let me through. Come on! Oh, come on. Please, take this guy away. Oh. Where am I? Welcome to the best place on earth! I'm great, I'm stuck with you, old people. I think you got the wrong guy, but I'm not who you think I am, honestly. Yeah, okay. Who else wears a pillow on their head? Well, you see, in this place, I see a lot of people. We got a lot of pillow men here. I'm not your guy. I have a feeling you think I'm your guy, because I'm telling you, you look a lot like someone I knew once, but trust me, I'm not... This, there's a whole multiverse of Pillow Man in this very prison. So you're saying, like, like it's into the Spider-Verse, but into the Pillow-Verse instead? Well, not exactly. You see, that's next season. I think you got the wrong impression, man. Honestly, I would, I would not say that, man. Listen, it couldn't have been all that bad, right? You your experience about? with your pillow man could have been all that bad right to like make you hate me so much oh yeah it, it's bad really come yeah. on i don't believe that for a second oh yeah okay he give me some examples bro every time i do something he doesn't give me any credit like that one time whenever santa told us to deliver the presents because he was quitting uh, he went to one house, thought he got caught, but he got caught by nobody and ran out and I delivered the presents. Ah. Uh, yeah, well, come on, there's got- that was just one time. There's, there's gotta be little more good times, right? I don't know. There was this one time that I was, you know, we were recording an episode and my cameraman had his finger over the lens the whole time. He thought, oh great, we gotta redo the whole thing, but I said, no, actually, that's brilliant. And then we kept doing it every episode after, like, that was, that, like, come on, there had to have been some moments like that. He didn't even notice me until I walked up to him, like, three episodes later. Come on, man, I couldn't have been, come on. All those times, it couldn't have been that bad. Like, there was this one time when... <sighs> Never mind. You're wasting your time, man. <sighs> Are you, are you sure you didn't have Pillow Frank? It's not my fault I'm in this room next to this fat ass who won't stop eating. Vietnam was easier than this shit. Hey man, if your whole character was eating, then um, you'd do the same thing. You'd, you'd enjoy it. Man, all three of you guys sound better than my guy. Man, was it really all that bad? Like, all was it really all bad times with him? Uh, yeah, he was... I mean, he was pretty bad. Man, I actually just remembered something. I remember this one time, I let my cameraman be the star of an episode. And it was this, he did so good, it was like he was made to be the star all along. Yeah, my pillow man would never let me do that. But there was a few times where I did show up, like, during his presidential campaign. He was introducing me, he only showed me for like a second though. Christmas, whenever we were delivering the presents and stuff, even though I did all the work, it was it was kind of fun. Even though he did run over somebody's grandma, which rest yeah, in peace. Yeah, that happens. That happens a lot with me too. Yeah, pillow talk. You know that was that was one of the best times I had with him. Actually, I was his co-host. 
You see? It wasn't all that bad, right, cameraman? Wait a second. Yep, that's right. It's me. I'm your pillow man. Well, you know, it was kind of hard to keep my secret. You know, at first I was kind of like, you know, kind of like upset because, you know, you're still mad at me. We kind of left on bad terms yeah. whenever I was with you in uh -huh. my timeline. But, like, man, <laughs> then I just started getting to the point where I'm like, man, I just like fucking with you, you know? Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> Oh, man, you should have seen the look on your face. I mean, I don't know what it looked like. I can't see, but it was pretty funny. Man, nobody could tolerate your shit. Yeah. Except for me. Yo? Yo? Yeah. Are we? Are we? I, I think we might be. Oh, shit. We're, we're so we're cool, right? Yeah. Man, this was really, like, fast. I mean, you were kind of being a dick for a minute there. Yeah, I mean... There's still some things, but, uh, it's, it's okay. Yeah, yeah, so, uh... It's kind of crazy how they didn't bother, like, changing clothes well, I mean, for they us. they put me in a red shirt. I don't know why red. I thought it was orange. I thought orange was the color, but I, I guess not. I mean, it used to be black and white stripes, and then they yeah, changed it to orange. Yeah, they changed it to orange, but, you know... I mean, this is... Is that hot? It feels like it'd be hot. It's a... It's a... Yeah, I mean, it's a little hot. Uh, I'm not burning right now. Uh, hey, man. You know what I think we should do? This is something I've been planning for a long time. But now the year, I think we can really pull it off. Alright. Let's break out of here. Sounds like a plan. Oh, I was waiting for this. Hey, Pillow Man 2, you ready to do this? We've been planning this for a long time, man. Well, you see, given that we're actually pretty much the same person, you already know the answer to that. Uh, yeah. Dark Pillow? What about you, man? I am going to betray all of you in the last minute in a very, very, extremely predictable betrayal. Yeah, that's to be expected, honestly. Hey, Pillow Woman! Oh, wait, that's that's right, we, we, we don't know any women. <sighs> hey, hey, what about Pillow with Bad Takes? Pillow with Bad Takes, what do you say? Oh my god, this is gonna be so good. Unlike your takes, yes. What did they do? They like World War II zombies. A lot. Animated pillow, what about you, man? I was made in paint. <laughs> yes, you were, you abomination, you. Boot like pillow man, what about you? What's his deal? Oh, you see, he's like a really racist caricature, so for the sake of saving our own asses, we, we kind of censor him. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's do this. Coach, listen, please. You gotta let me out of here, man. Hell no. Have fun. Do not drop the soap now, I promise you. But, Coach, you gotta trust me. It's me, Pillow Man. Last time I trusted you, you stabbed me right in the back, you son of a bitch. I didn't. I'm the real one. He's also the real one, but I'm the real one also. Also. I don't, how come I don't believe you then? Coach, listen. No, no, no. Not Coach. I'm gonna go deep here. Byron. Ba Byron Coxmere. I, I know you. My name is Byron, but it's not Coxmere. Oh. You fucked hard, My but bad, another it. guy. Another guy. I'll accept the credit, Look, though. It's a guy I knew in high school. Yeah, I, I went to high school. I think I knew him. He got arrested for overdosing on tobacco dip. Yeah, dip. Yeah, Grizzly Straight. Grizzly Straight. <laughs> did it Grizzly him. Straight is the dip for you. But no, listen, Coach. Trust me. Byron, I was there for you, remember? Whenever your wife was like trying to walk out on you, well, I, I ran over her legs so she wasn't able to walk anymore. Yeah. So then she had to stay with you. I remember that. She tried walking out on me because I called her a big old bitch. Remember? Uh, I remember. You were there for me. I appreciate it, now my brother. Do you, now do you believe me that I'm the real one? Yes. <laughs> oh, come here, brother. <laughs> I need you to do something for me, coach. I, I need it? you. Yes? What is it? I need you to distract past me. Hey, boss. Oh, what is it? What is it? So, it's been a while. We've been talking business, me yeah, and you. Yeah. Me and you. So, I just wanted to check on you because, you know, we're friends and all, bro. Right? And I'm yeah, like, I, 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 I mean, I don't really know who you are, honestly. I mean, I just kind of, I kind of just bought you out of a sweatshop in China, if I'm being honest. It was yeah. in India. And uh, oh. I, wanted to, I wanted to see, you know, man, how are you doing today? Good. All right, perfect. I'm glad to see. Uh, glad to see you're doing well. All right, I'm about to perform a magic trick. Would you like to see a magic trick? No, honestly, 
Oh, fucking no, but... Okay. Well, too damn bad. Nobody gave a shit about your opinion anyway. All right, I'm about to, I'm about to do a magic trick here. Alakazam, Alakazam, boy. Give me the best fucking Call of Duty out there. Infinite or... <laughs> Sims do pets. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, no, hold on now, hold on. So now, now but wait, there's, there's more. more. But wait, there's more. You can get Sims do pets with it for twenty dollars. But I was thinking, since you know we're friends and all, I want to know, would you like to play this with me? You know, because like Sims, Sims two on console is two player for some fucking reason, but. Yeah, it's a pretty fun game in my opinion. Here you go. The wrong fucking side. <laughs> Here you go. Honestly, never fucking talk to me again. Oh. All right, good. I've got it. I got the evidence. Thanks for helping, coach. But you still haven't explained how you're in two places at once. Uh, yeah, about that. Uh, you'll figure that out later. See ya. Wait a second. Why don't we just cut some prison yard? I thought we were gonna do like a cool breakout sequence with all the pillow men of the pillowverse. One, we don't have the budget for that. Two, we're way too lazy to film all that. And three, the writers of the script are way too lazy. Oh yeah, that makes sense to me. I've got the escape They're on to us. They're gaining on us. Wait a minute. Why? Why are we just running in place? Wouldn't it make much more sense if we actually, you know, ran forward? I don't think we have the budget for that right now. Yeah, you're right. We probably don't. Yeah. I've got the escape key. No! I've got the fat one with the pillow on his head! No! <laughs> no! Uh, here! No! Take this! This will solve all your problems. It's a piece of paper. No, it's not. It's a MacGuffin. Uh, this device, through the power of sheer writer's laziness, will solve all of your problems just immediately. Why didn't this device work for you? Because me and my cameraman were divided. Don't make the same mistake we did. Go. I won't forget you. I won't forget you either. Thanks for giving me a second chance. Now go! Whoa. Man, this thing is working already. Where have you been? Long story, you? Longer story. I doubt it. Where to? Anywhere but here. Whoa. Whoa. Is this what I think it is? I think that's that time we broke into somebody's house. Yeah, and remember? Oh, get down if you guys see us. Are you, are you still sure about this place? Listen, look, it's perfect. Okay, we're just gonna come here, film our ad, uh -huh. maybe take some food, some yeah, soap, I'm like, hungry. some soap, like at the hotel. You know how you just, it's like a, it's like a buffet yeah, yeah, for yeah. soap and stuff and towels and, and walls apparently for Mr. Krabs. Yeah. Well, man, they that. had some. Like said, just that soap. Mm. Yeah. Good call, of stealing it. That was some good ass alcohol. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that? Is that what I think it is over there? Is that the... It's, it's that dog that... The, the dog. I think that's just somebody's dog. Like their neighbor's dog, maybe. Like over there. Is that Doodle? Wait, no, that's right. Doodle is... Uh, my bad. Oh, yeah. Do, yeah, Doodle's, Doodle's Dr. Dr. Dog. dog. Yeah. Wow. Crazy. We didn't see that before. Yeah. I mean, it's not like I called it out any time, but... Yeah, uh, you never say anything. Let's get him! Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Do you see him? Uh, no, but I do see someone who got cheated out of his presidential election, so, you know, I'm just gonna put that out there. Very funny. Alright, come on, let's go. I think Dr. Dog has been around this whole time, under our noses. You don't have any nose. Well, I mean, I, I do technically, but, um, uh, whatever. The point is, I feel like he has been around every single time that cameras have been rolling. What? How can you be sure? I just... I have a feeling. Whenever I was at Pillow Talk, he was there. I just have a feeling he's been around more often. Doodle was Dr. Dawn, and Doodle has been around the whole time. Yeah, it's almost like I literally said it was your nemesis, like, whenever they're filming like this. 
Whatever. It's, 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 it's in the past now. So if Doodle's Dr. Dog, then that means... He was at our Halloween party. And our Christmas special. And he was at my restaurant whenever I was cooking. And you went to France with me. Which was, that was actually a great restaurant. Wait. Wait a second. I know where we have to go. We have to go back to my origin. Hmm, it seems like somebody was trying to say that earlier, but got knocked off. <laughs> oh, well, it's the past. Let's forget about it. You know there's no time in this place, where right? It could be any time. It could be no time. Whatever, whatever. Let's just let's go to my origin. Let's get him. All right? Yeah. All right, let's go. All right. Look, I'm investigating holes left in the ground by Dr. Dog. My distraction worked. Now once my device is charged, I can put an end to you once and for all. Huh? What was that? Ah, <laughs> uh, never mind. Wait, did you hear anything? No, I didn't hear anything. Oh, well, I guess it's time to tell you my origin story. It looks like passes are gonna be busy for a little bit. Yeah, and Dr. Dog's temporarily stuck here too. How'd you know he was going to be here? Oh, the MacGuffin told me. Oh, if only if we had one of those things earlier. Yeah, I know. It would have been very helpful. It would have been. Oh, I'm going to put an end to this, all right. Dr. Dog! Pillow Man, what a surprise. Don't you have an origin story to be telling? Wrong time period, idiot. We're from your time. What? What? How did you find me? Yeah, well, you weren't exactly subtle, leaving your paw prints all over the season. You're really sloppy, dude. You're like really dumb, man. Yeah, I thought this guy was an idiot, but you, Jesus. You call me an idiot, but I'm the one who's been living with you for six years. At first, I thought it was a little joke you were playing, but after the second or third week, yeah. Besides, it's too late for you. My time machine's all charged up and ready to go. What? Where did it go? Oh yeah, uh, this got rid of it. A piece of paper? No, it's our MacGuffin. <sighs> of course you have a MacGuffin. Why don't us villains ever get MacGuffins? Now this is just looking lazy. Yep, it sure is, but hey, what do you expect from an autistic college kid anyway? Isn't it about time we lock this guy up, wherever you are? Right here. Is it about time we lock this guy up? Yeah, I think it is. Alright, let's go. <laughs> I should have just taken that stupid soap opera roll. Oh well, good, we got him. You stopped Dr. Dog and saved all of reality. How do you feel, Bill Man? Actually, I didn't do it alone. I had help from this weird, crazy, psychopathic, narcissistic, completely insane, don't really know why he's following me for so Wait long a guy. And his name, it's my cameraman. I couldn't have done it without him. So you're actually giving me credit right now. Shh, don't get too used to it. Wait, you yes. just wait, hold on. Okay. How long have you been following me around for? Uh, it's hard to say. Ever since he got his powers. No, it's been like ever since I uh, did that thing one, uh, one day. Did you guys know each other before you were filming in? Or? This Honestly, isn't a group therapy, okay? Yeah. I'm sorry. Well, you, well, at least you both both in, I mean, finally accept each other as equals and save reality, you know? Good job on you guys. You solved your problem, your relationship problems, and you're all better. Okay, so does that mean we're, we're done here? Like, we can go home? So, alright, our reputation... So, so, you're, so, home is that way, right? Okay. Yeah, our reputation's... Way. Our reputation's saved. We... Alright. Not if I have anything to say about it. And I do. They are still criminals. I think they broke into a random civilian's home. Yeah. They stole their stream. Yep. Mm -hmm. And they, I, I could have sworn I saw Pillow Man steal some condoms, man. That's yeah. messed up right you, there. You forgot where I ran over Grandma, too. I was going to get to that. Okay. You bastard. <laughs>
Well, Th this man, this man ran over a bunch of old ladies. He yep. ran over someone's grandma. That, 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 sounds, that sounds about right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. this, well, for one thing, this man has a pillow on his head. I mean, yeah. how the fuck can this man see? I mean, it's well, fetish, you know? he's got pillow Think vision. about it like this. He's stunt Dr. Dog, who was going to, and I quote, change all of reality to his favor. That means you would be probably under his heel, or paws, whatever. So you'd be under control no matter what. That's safe, some bull safe. bullshit. I think they're still criminals. We need to lock them up right now because they, they're... Who, who the fuck runs over a grandma? Hey, hey, hey. Actually, you know what? Hey, I got, I got an idea, bro. I got an yeah, idea. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, you know how he can, like, change time and shit? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. What if you change time to make all that stuff we did in the past, not that I regret it, not happen? We should, we should ask him that. We yeah, should let's ask him, ask him that. Okay, you, you do it. All right. Uh, uh, hey, uh, director guy. Yeah? Could you, like, uh, run back and pass? Kind of make Hold all on. those I, things I, go I, away. I, I, I think I get what you mean. Sir, I say this with all my intention and good heart. I can literally erase you in a millisecond. I recommend you walk away now and forget everything they've done, or you don't exist. Hold on. <laughs> now, sir, if you don't leave, I will quote. Fuck you, huh? Oh. Okay. <laughs> this is so unfair! Oh! <laughs> what a... What a... What a... What a... There, there are no words to describe that guy. Anyway. Yes. You, think you think he's gonna be a problem in the future? Nah, I don't think so. Nah, I think you guys are good. Alright, well, uh... Good luck, you two. Alright! All right. Right. This is... This is this should be a national holiday. A national yeah, holiday. Dude. dude, this is like... We just got, like... Uh, this is great. It's yeah. Like, this is a national holiday, like like August fifth. August fifth. What's that? It's it's the best day ever. You never heard of it? It's it's just a normal Wednesday. Dude, it's more than. Dude, if August fifth falls on a Wednesday, you know what that means? No, I don't, because I'm a normal person. Dude, it doesn't matter. August fifth is you know what? Let's just. Oh let's hey, still... I know what August fifth is. Zip it. You know what? Let's go celebrate by having some good old toasted orange juice. Let's go, buddy. I still don't know about that. Wait, guys, are you you're just gonna walk home? Yeah. I can teleport you all. That's fine. No, we need to. You sure? It's like five steps away. Yeah. Oh, you know what? That's fine. Man, this stuff's actually pretty good. Yeah, it's the shit. What did I tell you? Man, today was actually pretty good. Yeah, you gotta right. admit it. Yeah, it was, I mean, it was this is pretty nice. crazy stuff. Yeah, it was crazy. We time traveled. Did you hear that? No? What are you talking about? Hello! What are you doing here? Congratulations, you solved the problem. Only you did it. You see, there's a bit of trouble in a little place I like to call the future. Yeah. So, are you ready to take care of it? I mean, it's kind of hot out here. I think I'm going to, like, change uh, outfits real quick. But, yeah, other than that, yeah, I'm ready. All right, where's the pillow? Where's, where, where is he? I think he's in the bathroom. I'm not sure. Well, All let right. Me, let me go see. Whoa! Is that you, Doc? Our cameraman told me a little bit about what we're doing. The future? Hell yeah, let's go!